Good morning, everyone. Good to see you again. Um, I'm so loving being a YouTube star. I have 63 followers. You'd be pretty impressed. Um, anyway, today I thought that we would do a different type of mini lesson where, like an in-process mini lesson, where I show you what it would look like to write a paragraph for the assignment that you're doing today. As you can tell, I've got a great little um, easel here that doesn't work so well, so hang with me. Um, I know I like the color too, Kylie Lampson. Um, so today I am going to show you what a reaction versus a summary would look like. So we're going to use our book New Kid again, and I'm really going to try to step away every few seconds so that you can see what it should look like. So the reaction I chose to write about today is, um, I'm, I kind of made an inference um, about one of the characters in New Kid. So if you remember, we have Jordan, our main character, Liam, who is the kid that's showing him around the school. And then we have a character, Andy, who is really kind of says insensitive things all the time. So in my paragraph, I'm going to start and say, Jordan in the book, and I'm going to put a comma, new kid, and I want to underline my book title, okay. meets a not so kind student named Andy. Okay, and you might not be able to see this all that well, but I will type this up and put it on. So I think, so if you remember when summarizing, you wouldn't put that I think in there. You just tell the characters, the setting, the conflict. When you're synthesizing or combining information from the book with your opinion, you do put the I think in there. I think Andy doesn't realize all the insensitive stuff he is saying. I need a new marker. Sorry about that, guys. Nothing can ever go right, can it? So true, Common. So true. Uh, and then I'm going to think about what are some of the insensitive things that he says, because I want to be very specific about what I'm sharing from the book as a reader. Um, so what is one insensitive comment that Andy makes? particularly to Ramon, if you remember. So I'm going to give you a minute to think about that. Charlie? Great. He says to Ramon, I bet your mom makes better tacos than the school. He says this because Ramon is Spanish and stereotypes him. Remember that word stereotypes? Like making a joke. Making a, sorry, we went in and out. Making a judgment. There we go. Making a judgment about someone based on their skin color or their religion or where they're from. And he's saying, Ramon, you must eat a lot of tacos because you're Spanish, which is a stereotype. Um, however, I don't really think he's saying it necessarily to be mean. I just don't think he knows any better. So that's kind of my inference here, which was my reaction. 
um, is that Andy really doesn't realize what he's saying is somewhat racist. So my first, you can see here, this reaction that I made is one, two, three, four sentences long. So you definitely want to have evidence from the book. So take a, think about what was some of the evidence from the book that I shared. Christina? Yes. We talked about Ramon. We talked about how uh, Andy says you think your mom makes better tacos. Um, how Andy says insulted, insensitive stuff. So those are all pieces of evidence from the story of characters' names. I have specifics that they say. And it's about four sentences long. So you're going to review the reactions to reading sheet that I sent you. And I want you to choose one, or you could do two, if you're finding your reaction is very short. One reaction to share. As you can see, I've got a student teacher. Grady, who had to be in the video. Grady, yeah. can you please move? Go. Um, in your route, student teacher number two, there's Maddie. All right, Maddie, out of the video. Thank you. Please stop, kids. I want to see you again. All right. So that is what it looks like. I'll type this up for your Google Classroom, and you all did a wonderful job today. I miss you all so much. Um, hopefully when I go viral. Bye. Um, You'll all still reach out to me. Uh, so have a great day, and we will all see you later. Everybody Yay! say bye. Bye.